welcome to another It Is That Simple tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to record part of your screen using ScreenFlow. I'm actually using QuickTime to record this because I cannot use ScreenFlow to record it while I'm showing you. So if the, if the resolution is really bad, it's because I'm using QuickTime. Okay, so up here on the, on the right of your screen, you will see the ScreenFlow icon. Click on it and you will see record, pause, end marker and configure recording. That's the one you want. Click on it. So you will get this window. All that you're interested in is this square here with you know, like marching ants here. Next to the recording button, you've got the square. So when you click on the square, there you go. Anything within, within this square, within this shape will be recorded, anything. Uh, you can change its size. You can go here, you can make it smaller, bigger, however you want. And simple. That's how you do it. The only reason I'm bothering with this because it did take me some time to find out how to do this. If you have a, a big screen like mine, like I have a 27 inch, it's just, you know, you just don't want to record your whole screen. This is perfect. Excellent. All right. Okay. So it is really that simple. I do have ongoing tutorials that are coming up, so be sure to subscribe just in case you need help. Look, I do mainly um, absolute beginner stuff, so if you're looking for something more in depth, I am not your person. Okay, but if you like one quick stuff, subscribe. Surely I will try to help you as much as I can. Okay, so until next time, take care of yourself and we'll see you in the next video. Don't get me mad or dizzy. <laughs> what is it? My swag is irregular, hard is irregular. Drive the vehicle and park is irregular.